Hey guys, so here's some flight footage of the V-Rotor 130. I uh, finally got out and, and flew it a little bit. On this first day, it was really cloudy and um, I didn't really have a good view through the FPV screen and didn't feel too comfortable flying at FPV, so I just did some line of sight and um, I noticed that there was, uh, you can't really see it in the video, but there's like this noticeable, uh, how, do you, how do you explain it? The, the quad wanted to go to the right. It had this tendency to want to drift to the right. And, um, and with this tendency to, to drift to the right, it, it was making uh, FPV flight difficult and the um, lighting conditions didn't help either. Day two. So uh, a couple days later, it was sunny, and I went to a nearby park where they had a soccer field. I did uh, some FPV flying here, and uh, it seemed to fly fairly smooth. Nothing too remarkable to note here. I wasn't really pushing the quad that, that much. I only flew a couple batteries uh, during my lunch break, so uh, everything seemed to be fairly predictable. It handled pretty nice. Um, Nothing to be too concerned about. Day three. So here, on, on, uh, this is the third day that I went and flew the B rotor, and uh, was at a at a was on a race day, and it was just me flying uh, this course here. It was uh, not easy for me as a beginner, uh, but I uh, and I was getting uh, passed by the other larger quads. They were much faster than me. Uh, but I did notice that on the turns, the quad was shaking quite a bit, and uh, I think it was an indication that I'd probably need to either decrease my D or increase my P. I'm going to uh, look into that probably for the next play. I'm going to uh, take advantage of the black box that's on here. There's uh, two megabytes of uh, data flash storage on this Naze uh, 32 Rev 6. So uh, for the next flights, I think I'm going to do some black box recording and see where these oscillations are coming from. I'm not sure if they're, um, not exactly sure if I need to increase or, or in, increase or decrease my, my gain, so I'll have to uh, uh, do some experimentation. And I'll bring some of those videos to you in the future, so stay tuned to my channel.